stunning high wire act on the Golden Gate Bridge this week. It's not a prank or a protest. KPIX 5's Emily Turner says it's an inspection like it's never been done before. They may look more like trapeze artists or stunt doubles, but these daredevils are actually inspectors. Uh, how, uh, how can I put this? Uh, it's, a little, it's a little crazy. I don't think I'd be doing that. Can't imagine doing that for a day job. But a day job it is, and an important one. The work that is done here helps us set a path for what comes in the years ahead. So depending on what these inspectors find, we will be looking at the work plan for our painters, our iron workers, and the other maintenance staff. So for the next week, inspectors will be climbing up and dangling off of the Golden Gate Bridge, looking at every rivet and every seam. Federal regulations have changed and now require what's called an arm's length inspection on some of the more delicate parts of the bridge. So while engineers are up there doing that, they figure they might as well look at the entirety of the bridge and make sure that's safe at arm's length as well. And to make sure the inspectors are safe, they have a team of 12. Six do the inspecting while the other half handle the rigging. There's also scaffolding along part of the walkway to make sure the people below are safe. It's the first time the bridge has had an inspection like this, but moving forward, it'll happen every two years. Take a look. This is a site you haven't seen here before at the Golden Gate Bridge. These people are there legitimately. This is not a prank. However, we'd ask you to take a quick look and keep moving. You don't want to be the cause of a traffic collision or congestion. On the Golden Gate Bridge, Emily Turner, KPIX 5. The bridge district wants to reassure drivers the inspections will never take place directly over traffic.